Okay, as hello everybody, as I promised you on my blog, uh, here's the unboxing of the HTC Tattoo that I just bought. So this is the small box. Yeah, I hoped for a bigger box, but you know as they say, is uh, good things come in small packages. So this is it. Yeah, let's open it. See what we've got inside. Yeah. First thing is the two gigabyte micro SD card. Then mm, this and this are the power sockets. Yep. Yeah. The USB transfer cable from the device to the PC. The standard 3.5 jack headset. Yeah. This is pretty good because you can put better quality headset if you want on the device. Okay, inside warranty statement, HTC care, some original accessories from HTC, the warranty, and at the bottom of the package, we hope is the device. <laughs> yeah, here it is. The small and cute HTC tattoo. As you can see the controls on front. Search, power off, call, menu, home, back. It's on 1.6 Android. 3.2 fixed focus camera, the 3.5 millimeter uh, stereo jack, the volume knob on, on the left side, the USB connector and the microphone. Yeah. Okay, let's open it. The battery protected by a foil. As you can see, it's a standard 1100 milliamps. Yeah. Okay, on this side we can find the micro SD card slot. Okay, let's put the card that received with the phone inside. As you can see, it's a hot swappable card. This means that you can have the phone functioning and you can remove it. Let's put the battery back on. I'll start the phone, but I'll show it like this in order not to do free advertiser advertising for somebody else. Let's put the back battery cover on. Yeah, the plastic is not so good quality wise but it it fits good, it snags good, it nothing moves, nothing isn't as it sh should be. Yeah so it's for those who don't know it's a 2.8 inch in diagonal. Here's the small Android robot. It's got the 528 MHz uh, processor, 256 MB of RAM system memory, which allows uh, for Android 2.0 and 2.1 upgrades, unlike other phones which uh, are limited to this version of Symbian 1.6. So, yeah, since it needs to charge, you know the standard uh, display, it's got a good uh, touch and interface implemented. The screen, even if it's uh, resistive, it's got a very good sensitivity, as you can see. The phone is pretty fast. Yeah. You can personalize it, you can put different skins, different covers and backsides. So, 
up till now I'm, I'm pretty pleased with what I bought and uh, as I promised I'll come back with a uh, more in-depth review after I have the time to to find all the goods and uh, bads of this phone yeah. so hope you enjoyed my my short unboxing video take care uh, bye bye